looking at a calendar view, which as you can see, starts off with what are the things that need to be done today? Now, by the way, if you're a little late, there's another column that says what are the past due items as well. But a calendar view of what are all of the things that you have to do today, next week, next month in order. Now, if you look at the top here, now you can start to sort this by everyone in the firm or possibly just one partner in the firm. So one partner, what are their jobs to do today? Or even by client. So by client, irrespective of who's managing that client, what are the jobs to do in the firm that day? And it's dynamic, it's real time. Now, at any time, you can update one of these cards. So if you, for example, take an action on one of these tasks, it's extremely simple. You click on the task. You can block it so now nobody else can work on that if that's what you want to do, if that's your client. And then if you need to create a new task or a new job, very easy to fill this out. You can assign it to somebody in your firm. Uh, you can put a due date on there, which obviously will move where that shows up in terms of the calendar view. And immediately, it will get added. Now, you can see the progress bar as well. We'll always tell you exactly if there's four tasks. We'll tell you, are your three quarters complete? Have you not started yet? So where are each of the tasks? And then this is super important as well. If you need something from a client, there's collaboration built right in. So if you need a document, you can simply open up the task. You can ask that client for a document. That client will then return that document into Practice Manager, and obviously will update the task. And then at the very end there, what you saw was a picture of all of this on a phone. So if you're outside of the office, you can still work on all of these same things in Practice Manager.